Sean Scully, born 1945. Grey Wolf, 2007. This painting by Sean Scully looks like a scrambled chessboard with 25 squares instead of 64. The horizontal and vertical stripes are arranged into blocks, but the order is continually broken. The stripes of various lengths run parallel or branch off one another at right angles, and some even interlock. The gray, black, white, and pink color tones are muddied. The painting looks a little like a flag carpet. The viewer's eye scans the painting continually. It is intrigued by the way the unevenness of the lines and the paint application and thinks it sees some fields standing out in front of others. Nothing is perfect. That's the way it should be, because for Sean Scully, perfect paintings are dead paintings. Scully's works are characterized by his intensive work with paint and paintbrush. The artist uses a house painting brush and leaves visible traces of it. He applies the paint in multiple layers, wet on wet, so that the various colors fuse into one another. The generous amount of oil mixed into the paint as a binder makes the surface of the painting shine. The choice of color is thought over, and the tonal relationships within the image are continually readjusted throughout the process of painting a picture. This continues until a work is completed, the sense of the unresolved that arises when looking at Grey Wolf is also part of the process of its development. Gradually more and more holes become visible between the color fields, making it possible to make out the pattern and divisions sketched out in chalk underneath. The Irish-born artist lives and works in Barcelona, New York, and Munich. His style is influenced by American minimalism and abstract expressionism. He works with a reduced formal language and color palette. However, there are no boundaries placed on the variety of possible constellations. Within his paintings, there is a great personal strength and emotional intensity, aspects that also guide the artist during the creative process. Sean Scully creates architecture from his personal experiences. He fuses together things that he sees and feels, thus piecing together a new reality. Visit the Museum of Fine Arts Ban and see the original works. And download the free app Museen Ban from the App Store.